On the 11th day of Christmas, Magic and Puck was testing a fishing toy. Many toys made on the Juliana had loose parts, and this was one of them. If you really played and put your heart into it, you could accidentally make a component fly right through any regular sized living room. And they discovered how any flying toy would simply direct the mom robot. She'd pick up the toy and make an effort to try to return it. The programming behind the action was originally made for picking up dropped teddy bears. And if you dropped two teddy bears before the first one could be returned, she'd prioritize and change direction. She was capable of identifying even the smallest toy at a very high speed. And this meant that if you had enough little flying teddy bears, you could steer her in a particular direction. We are going to lure the mom robot into the dropship, said Melchick. Use the emergency remote control and fly the dropship into space. Then we'll call Santa and we'll call Raven and they'll make the final decision together. Whether to blow her into space or not. At least we're not going to have her around here anymore. If anything goes wrong, we've still got the switch. Let's go. The kids went looking for the mom robot in every corner of the Juliana. But it was as if she'd completely vanished. And apparently she'd forgotten her sweater as well. Funny, because that sweater was always part of the original design. 